the International Potato Center, in collaboration with the World Vegetable Center, is implementing a four-year project between 2011 and 2015 called EWOS AID Horticulture Project CIP AVRDC Bangladesh with funding support from EWOS AID Feed the Feature Program. The goal of this project, increasing income and nutrition, over 100,000 poor marginal farmer households in southern Bangladesh. This goal will be accomplished through six components of the project. Selection of new varieties adapted to local farming and food systems. Development of innovative seed supply strategies for PRCs. Improved crop management and cropping systems for productivity and health. Strengthening of value chain for enhancing nutritional value and income through PRCs. Build multi-sectoral partnership and collaboration. Innovative potato storage for smallholder farmers. These components focus on strengthening food security and system level innovation through promotion and production of project-related crops, potato, orange-fleshed sweet potato and nutrient-rich vegetables. US AID Horticulture Project is working in five districts of southern Bangladesh. As the number of target households increase over year, the working area will increase too. Nearly 50% participants are women. It is often not easy to ensure gender equality in agricultural projects when production systems depend on a land ownership inequality in land inheritance law and predominant patriarchal society often deny women's access to land which ultimately makes women resource poor for this reason the horticulture project has designed a gender responsive strategy to empower women through different research and development activities like home garden promotion tomato seedling production through grafting technology and sweet potato vine multiplication for quality planting material. Anjuna Rani Bishash of Potangali village in Jasol mixes compost manure with soil and fills her plastic cups before sowing Bari HYV8 tomato seeds. She waters the cups and places in seed bed. After seven days, she sows EG203 high yielding variety eggplant seeds applying same process. After eggplant seedlings become 21 days and tomato seedlings 28 days, Anjuna starts grafting. First, she cuts the upper end of an eggplant seedling slantingly. Same way, she cuts the upper end of tomato seedling. Then, she puts an auto-dissolving connective tube on the lower end of eggplant seedlings and inserts the upper end of the tomato seedling inside the tube. This is how she does grafting for producing healthy tomato seedling. Rootstock of EG203 eggplant HYB is resistant to bacterial wilt and water logging. Thus, a tomato seedling raised through grafting is less susceptible to disease. Grafted seedling has very high survival rate. Pasta mohila ke ami dekhe bolchi dako, ei kadra shuru hase ta tumra ki korba, ta shakon bollo ke hai ami korbo. Pas jonne shami kase shuna hulo, shakon bollo ke hai amader mata mata sa. Tamra shakon trading shuru kore dila, shakon hase sara toy rihe gas hai gap team sarao, normal sarao, duo sarao amra. এখন কৃষকের কাছে বিক্রি করতে পারছে এখন দেখা আছে আমরা ক্যামেরা ক্যামেরা একটু লাভবান হওয়ার পুরো গ্রাম হয়ে যাচ্ছে আমি এই যে সারা বিক্রি করব করার পরে যে টাকা হয় আমার কাছে থাকে আমার স্বামী যখন লাগে শামু আমার কাছে না স্বামী আগে সহযোগিতা করেছে ইনকামের আমু তার সঙ্গে আমু ইনকামের সহযোগিতা আমু করে দিচ্ছি আগে আমার স্বামীর কথা শুনতাম এখন আমার কথাও আমার স্বামী শুনে এখন আমার Orange fleshed sweet potato OFSP varieties are developed through collaborative research between the International Potato Center and Bangladesh Agricultural Research Institute, Bari. These orange fleshed sweet potato are important source of beta carotene, the precursor to vitamin A.
Report Joygun of Chowkacha Upazila in Jasore is improving her status by multiplying OFSP vines. OFSP vines multiplication is very simple. One needs to bury OFSP vine in a slightly dig hole and water a little. Joygun says she can make the dense green OFSP vine nursery simply watering the field twice a day. Frequency of watering reduces once the plants are established. She started her nursery with 30 vine cuttings. Now it becomes dense green. Our sponsor, Otter Silo, Dai Baraka Haira Ailo, Ashar Pore, Amra Terry Dia, Tamal Lata Dilo, Dear Pore Ami Al Lata Biki Gorisi, Lunizu Pasho Biki Gorisi, Verago Dizi, Amra Nizak Haisi Parapotivajiro Dizi. আমি <laughs> মনে করে আমাদের ভালো হচ্ছে আমার বাচ্চা কাচ্চারও ভালো হচ্ছে আর পরে নাগমন আমরা ভালোই হচ্ছে আগে থেকে অনেক রোগ বলে একটু ছেড়ে আসছে রোগ বলে আর থাকছে না লতার চাষ করে আমাদের এটা আয়ও হচ্ছে সুনামও হচ্ছে আমাদের ভালোই মনে করো আসি অরেঞ্জ ফ্রেশ সুইট পটেটো ইজ মোস্টলি এডিবল ওয়ান ক্যান ইট দ্য লিভস রুটস এন্ড ভাইন্স ইটস আ রেজিলিয়েন্ট ক্রপ নোন অ্যাজ দ্য ক্লাসিক ফুড সিকিউরিটি ক্রপ it can be grown with minimum label, integration and chemical fertilizer. OFSP is a cheap nutritious solution for developing countries needing to grow more food on less area for rapidly multiplying populations. In 18 months, the project trained 30 women on tomato seedling production through grafting technology and about 1300 women on sweet potato vine multiplication. Evidences from year one show these women earned good amount of money. The project is being implemented through different partners. The project hopes that these innovative approaches in horticulture will uplift rural women in Bangladesh economically and socially. They will establish control over productive assets.